<laughs> yeah. Thank you very much for coming in Slovenia, yeah. Uh, I thought that you had some delays, you know, but uh, right now I see a white BMW. I thought it was a GS, but then I realized that you mentioned the RT. Yes. Yeah, yeah, very, very nice one. Let me welcome you to today's episode. Six hundred fifty CC bike, six positions. So yeah. the plan, the uh -huh. plan for today is to go a bit to Notranska. Okay, this is just uh, the south way of Ljubljana. Okay, a bit 30, 40 kilometers okay. there, and then uh, go back to Postojna. Uh -huh. Okay, and then from Postojna to the Kars region. Okay, so the Kars region is. Uh, more than region with Italy, okay. but uh, there are very specific uh, land and uh, underground forms, okay. you know, to see, and there is a castle, very nice one, okay. uh, that uh, had a very uh, unique meaning also okay. uh, in the past, and uh, it's on a hill, uh -huh. but uh, inside the castle, like uh, Sigishwara yeah. in Romania, uh -huh. there is a village, oh, okay. so people uh, live there, and uh, you will okay. see, yeah. uh, and uh, then uh, uh, there is a plan to go to the coastal area, okay. so Slovenia and Istria, okay. and uh, there are nice views uh, to the coast, to, yeah, to the sea, okay. Adriatic Sea, and also Trieste. Hi guys, welcome to the channel. I am with Tony Reno from Two Wheel for Fun from USA and we are now leaving Postojna and uh, go a bit sightseeing uh, with uh, the motorcycles. So uh, if you want to know what we are gonna see, uh, please stay with us. Here we are guys, this is a Slovenian tale of the dragon and it's called Kacieride.
here we are in Rakos Kocian. This is a natural beauty uh, and it is a monument of uh, the national importance and uh, you're gonna see what it's all about. And here it is in all its glory. <laughs> the big natural bridge. How many years did it take the river to... You have millions. Millions of years. Yeah, millions of years, yeah. So, as you see, just a piece of water, a little uh, water here. Otherwise, when it's raining, when there comes a rainy season, it means in autumn and also early spring. Here it's a bit more water, because this is a karst area, karst terrain, and uh, the water is coming from the underground up. But uh, when there is uh, summertime, like now, uh, here it's no water, that's why uh, this is the, let's say, uh, a phenomena of uh, the karst terrain. So guys, this was the great natural bridge and the river Rak. We are now heading to Predjamski Grad, so Predjamski Castle. This is uh, one of the few castles, if not the only one, that uh, has the real connection with the cave and uh, there is a nice story about the Erasem uh, Predjamski so uh, he was a smuggler as we all know and uh, he used this uh, castle uh, for his own purposes this is the Predjamski Grad, so the Predjamski Castle, as you see, a very nice castle that it's connected with the cave Erasem Predjamski, and he was uh, known uh, for smuggling, smuggling uh, from uh, country to country, and uh, probably here he had also some uh, secret places inside the cave to uh, to to have some material that uh, he was taking with him on his roads yes, yes. you know uh, the smuggling roads that he had so we are now riding uh, these twisties just in the direction to Staniel I hope that Anthony is enjoying he is on his BMW RT so he went from Germany all the way to see Slovenia at least some parts of Slovenia and uh, I am taking uh, him to Staniel so the castle Staniel the castle Staniel it's well known because of its park there uh, that was designed by Max Fabiani a well-known architect from the beginning of the 20th century and uh, why it's Max Fabiani so famous? Uh, probably because of his so-called connections with Adolf Hitler but uh, these uh, may not be really true so uh, anyways uh, uh, you will see uh, this uh, beautiful piece of art uh, so the garden that uh, he designed uh, in front of the castle and uh, also the castle itself it's a very nice uh, castle just up the hill uh, it is uh, let's say well preserved and also people live there What about this one, Anthony? Some would say two wheels for fun. Two wheels for fun, But yeah. now we can only say walking is fun. Walking is fun. Yeah. yeah. Two feet for fun. Two feet for fun, yeah. I mean, it's beautiful now, but you see it from above. Yeah, yeah, and there you have some, uh, some, some fish inside, you see? Yeah. 
<laughs> this lavender it's pretty common uh, here and they make i don't know if you know but they make also soap soap yeah lavender soap so yeah from 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 it from <laughs> very nice one so this bridge is uh, let's say a copy of uh, that one in uh, i think in venice okay uh, when they have a wedding here uh -huh. uh, the bride goes here you know so, okay. on this bridge and then uh, they yeah, try to to make photos yeah here and so on yeah. this is castle Sotserp. San Servolo in Italian. Those of you who are interested in this castle and this area, please check my video about the Sotserp castle and the holy cave. Uh, here it is a, a bit longer video, but I think that it's still worth watching. So here you can see Anthony, the Slovenian port. This is port of copper. Yeah, and here you can see the Trieste, so port of Trieste. Oh, okay. And we are here somewhere in the middle. Down there it's Italy, down here it's Slovenia. And this castle, it's on the rock. You will see right now the castle. This is the castle, it's also from the medieval times. And you see it's built on a rock here. It's uh, on a proper edge. We are in Copper right now, this is our final destination, so uh, this is the only Slovenian port city, I mean uh, for the cargo, and uh, right now we are heading to reach the main square, so uh, this is uh, the so-called Tito Square. So you probably know Tito, it was the uh, long-term uh, socialist Yugoslav leader. So there is a nice uh, cafe. So guys, I hope that you enjoyed, this is all for now, please do me a favor and subscribe and uh, till the next one.